Rolly, rolly. Say Mark. Action. What's really unique to me about Bad Boys is the action is real. This movie was kind of a little bit of everything. Driving, fights, no! wire work, choreography. We cover the gamut. So often, you know, you go on some movies and you don't get to do half of the stuff because they just do it digitally. And so it's been fun for us to be able to actually get our hands into it. Michael Bay is a genius. I mean, with hands down, he's unbelievably great at what he does. The first challenge is, hey, how are we going to one-up or outdo the first two? It is big shoes to fill. How was it to work with Michael Bay? Intense. It was this all day, every day, just like we're doing now, continuing it on. You see that? They threw in cars. How am I not see that? Special effects and, and I kind of go hand in hand on every movie, right? We're kind of attached at the hip. I build the gags, so I lean on them to, sh to put it through the paces. I would say to him, hey, this is what I need. I need, you know, all these parameters for the car to keep my performer safe. So you build it, they ride it around, see how it's gonna react. Definitely a partnership for sure with him and I. because our directors wanted so much of this stuff real and in camera. My biggest concern was just how to get Will and Martin through all this stuff and doing it safely. So it's a real challenge, but uh, we're really going for that challenge. Yeah, we made some stunt adjustments on this movie. My, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a little hard on me. Yeah, sure. uh, You know, I don't have, my back ain't, ain't the best back in the world, but uh, we get the job done. Yeah, and we got good stuntmen. Yeah, for sure. And if you got good stuntmen, why not use them? Exactly. <laughs> the club is, you know, two stories and everything has to seem seamless. So first unit is obviously very based with uh, the actor. Jump now, she! And then second unit obviously is majority of stunt performers that are portraying them. First unit now knows, hey, this is what we shot. This is what you guys shot. One, drop! So now you feel like, okay, now they're gonna merge together. Jump now, she! There's a lot of pieces that go into making an exciting stunt sequence. They get out of the club, a big chase takes place. Everything has got to be safe for, for everyone. What's the shot we want? And what can I put our actor in to still make the audience feel like they've been in the whole shot, but part of it's going to be a double and part of it will be green screen work. Hey, can you pull off for a second? I think Marcus needs to go potty. Damn it, Mike. And part of it will be our hero. And then you start to add elements to it. First, it's just the bike. Okay, cool, this is the path. Then you start to add a couple cars. You're like, okay, now we're gonna weave around these cars. Everyone's going, you know, the same speed. This is your route. You know, and as long as everyone stays on point, everyone goes home safe, no one's drinking out of a straw. I've been driving motorcycles since I was like eight years old. I had motorcycle lessons with him. He was easy, he'd jump on a bike, no problem. They didn't really use the stunt guy the way they should, because I did a couple of my things. I can't say I did all the stunts, because I'm not 20 years old anymore, you know, but uh, I did pretty good. We got here a stunt guy. <laughs> What's your name, brother? What's up, Dan? Dan. And here we got real Nicky Jam. I'm not supposed to show him, I want people to think it's me, man. The stunt guys, he's like ready for, for, for action, they're ready for the, the real deal, so I love working with them. They wanted the feel of like wheelie boys, so they wanted the guys that could 12 o'clock. Really looked at some of the, you know, the world's best motorcyclists were unbelievable. And the directors had this cool idea where they wanted them to like do circle wheels around the car while our gears were in the car. And then while the shootout's going on. We got uh, 250 squibs going off. In addition to that, front end guns inside, which shoots a projectile out. Most of the time it frags as it comes out the front window. Right. And all our wheelie boys and, and our girl back here, uh, you guys are just hammering. And then finally, 
Unfortunately, our heroes hijack a motorcycle with a sidecar. So now there's a gun battle on the live freeway. I got to shoot a machine gun. <laughs> oh, yeah! I had fun. That, that wasn't bad. I don't know how much Will loved it. Yeah. But. No, that, you know, that's going to be one of the signature scenes of this movie. It's just so uniquely bad boys. We did uh, one scenario on a trailer that was safe and that we could tow them, and it was uh, all limited. But then we also had to build one for stunts that they could free drive. And in fact, they're blowing cars up. Yes! They're doing poppers. We have uh, bikes going down. The separation rig where we were able to separate Will so as a free drive bike. And then we took the little sidecar and we built a go-kart under it. So when they kicked apart, it dropped and it looked like it was skidding and we had sparks and then the stunt guy could drive it like a little go-kart and he's ping-ponging off of cars. You know, this whole big flatbed trailer that's carrying propane explodes. Then a helicopter comes into play. We up here. We up here right now. You know how like when you swing in a swing too high? Yeah. And you get that free fall feeling of, oh. Yeah. All right, guy, you got me? You got me, bro? Yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'd never been in a helicopter. <laughs> and I still haven't. <laughs> Moving detective. The finale sequence when you know we're dealing with you know 20 guys in this room, they're all getting shot. Tons of explosions, and we dropped a whole staircase with stunt guys on it. We dropped a balcony with a stunt guy on it that had to write it down. The directors wanted like fire, tons of gunfire with stunt players that are squibbed up that are getting shot. Martin and Will take cover behind a table that they kind of roll and it's taking fire. Will and Martin were in every one of those shots. We basically just used doubles to map it out and rehearse, rehearse, make sure camera was where it needs to be and kind of back into it that way. Right, so show the next part that we would. And then once we had it perfect, then our heroes would run it once. Okay, everyone's good. And then two, three. We would go hot and then everything would be on. Yeah. You're reading through and it's like helicopter crash, motorcycle crash, car crash, car flip, car explosion. Oh! You're just going, yeah, Michael Bay would be proud. Yeah, I think he'd have his moments where he'd be like, yeah, good job. I just love when, like when you know that you're making a classic bad boy scene. Oh, shit. That's going to be remembered for a long time. It will be. <laughs> Ooh. Get me the fuck out of this car. Hope you liked the video. Now, staying on the DC theme, Will Smith trained with Navy SEALs to play Deadshot. In order to give Deadshot his all, Smith went and trained with Navy SEALs and Army Rangers to ensure that the way Floyd Lawton handled weaponry would be as convincing and realistic looking as humanly possible. Now, do you like my t-shirt? You can get one too. Click on the link in the description.